Okay, we're in the new Captivate 5.5. We're going to show you how to create some effects using the new effects panel. So over on our timeline, we created a couple polygons of this star and put them around in a, a circle shape. You can create any shape you want or use any image you'd like. And then we go over to the effects panel to show you how we can add effects. So notice on our main timeline, we have a bunch of polygons here. And if I click on effects, I'm only selecting that one graphic and its timeline on the effects panel. We see one polygon there for three seconds. Just like we see on the timeline, we have the polygons are there for three seconds. I have, on the timeline, I have about eight polygons, but when I click on one and go to the effects panel, we only see one. Then I can go to click add effect to add an effect to this star that's currently selected. I click on add effect. I'll go over to entrance, the way it, this has a lot of animations that can animate the star entering the screen and I can try to do something like a fly-in and have this star fly in from bottom right. Alright, we'll go ahead and preview this movie. I'll press, I'll go to file, preview, project. You can see the star flying in from the right and I'll close that preview window. I could add more, I could even click on this little one right here, and you'll see that it shows me the direction of the star. So I can change where the star is going to start from. Even though it says flying from bottom, I can have it come in from the top right here and end up in this space. And I can also do a live preview right here to test. And we see the star flying right in. Very easy. I could also add a combination of animations and effects. So I'm going to delete this with the trash can so you can see how I delete an animation and we'll try something new add effect entrance and come in mystery which is just a, a mystery animation and I'll <laughs> click on live preview pretty neat and it scales in and that's how to make effects using the new Captivate 5.5 try a bunch of effects and try even adding a bunch of effects together like I can say rotation and have this rotate one time and it'll rotate and come in as a mystery. Let's see what that looks like. Actually, first I'll view magnification and I'll set it to, well, it's already set to best fit, but there we go, best fit. And I'll press live preview. And there you have it, creating effects using Captivate 5.5.